emotions, bodily sensations or memories from the past that you may have long forgotten. All of these things can come up. And the idea with psilocybin ther therapy is to be curious about those, um, to go to the dark places in your mind where you might find um, a little gem of insight about why you might be feeling the way you're feeling. Ämnet psilocybin som finns i så kallade magiska svampar kan lindra patienter med svårbehandlad depression. Det visar en ny studie. This is an exciting finding. It's easily the biggest study of its kind so far. Okay, we need bigger ones to come, but it is the biggest. It's very very clearly statistically significant, which is exciting, and it offers a new avenue to treat patients with considerable unmet need. 233 patienter som tidigare fått två antidepressiva läkemedel utan effekt ingick i försöksgruppen. De tog ämnet och hamnade i ett drömlikt tillstånd i 4 till 6 timmar under uppsikt. There are some characteristic effects like um, misperception so things can start to look strange, your sense of time can speed up or slow down. Många patienter upplevde att deras depression avtog, men det uppstod också bieffekter som självmordstankar och huvudvärk. Kritiker varnar för vad som kan hända om folk börjar experimentera med magiska svampar på egen hand. Forskarna bakom studien säger att det dröjer minst tre år och fler studier innan det kan finnas ett säkert läkemedel med ämnet. It's been difficult to develop these drugs because there was their illegality, so there was a lost generation or even two when they were simply not used in man by medical profession. So we've got a lot of catch up to do and we are part of that catch up.